From true crime chronicles to bone-chilling horror novels, their book recommendations promise to be a literary journey that mirrors the eerie and enigmatic narratives they explore in their podcasts. Join us as we unlock the cryptic pages curated by Morbid Podcast, where each book recommendation is a key to unlocking the mysteries that lurk in the darkest corners of literature. As we delve into the abyss of their book suggestions, we unearth narratives that align with the eerie and unsettling tales they narrate in their podcasts. From gripping true crime accounts that send shivers down the spine to haunting horror tales that linger long after the last page is turned, Morbid Podcast book recommendations promise a literary experience that mirrors the ominous and enigmatic nature of their show. Join us as we unravel the secrets hidden within the pages suggested by Morbid Podcast, each book becoming a portal to the dark recesses of literature, where the mysteries of the unknown await. If you find this video helpful, don't forget to like, comment, and share. If you're new to this channel, hit the subscribe button and press the bell icon to never miss an update. Links to the books are given in the description below. Number 10. The Stranger Beside Me, Ted Bundy, The Shocking Inside Story by Anne Rule. An acclaimed American true crime author established herself as a trailblazer in the genre, delivering riveting narratives that peel back the layers of notorious criminal cases. Her expertise in criminal psychology, coupled with a journalistic flair, sets her apart. In The Stranger Beside Me, Rule tackles one of the most chilling cases in American history, the story of Ted Bundy. What makes Rule's account particularly gripping is the personal connection she had with Bundy before his true nature was revealed. As a former colleague and friend, Rule's insider perspective adds a haunting layer to this exploration of one of the most infamous criminals of the 20th century. The Stranger Beside Me is a chilling journey into the psyche of one of America's most infamous serial killers, Ted Bundy. And Rule's unique position as both a crime writer and an unwitting acquaintance of Bundy lends an unparalleled depth to this true crime classic. Rule's meticulous research, combined with her personal insights, creates a narrative that is both detailed and emotionally charged. This book is not just a recounting of Bundy's heinous acts but also an exploration of the unsuspecting individuals who crossed paths with evil. The Stranger Beside Me is a masterclass in true crime storytelling, a harrowing account that leaves an indelible mark on the reader's psyche. Number 9. Finding Me – A Decade of Darkness – A Life Reclaimed – A Memoir of the Cleveland Kidnappings by Michelle Knight a survivor and an empowering voice, rose from the depths of a decade-long nightmare to share her harrowing yet inspiring story in Finding Me. As one of the victims of the Cleveland kidnappings, Knight's memoir is a testament to her resilience, strength, and unwavering determination to reclaim her life. In sharing her experiences, Knight sheds light on the indomitable human spirit's ability to endure even the darkest of circumstances. Finding Me is not just a memoir. It's a triumph of the human spirit over unspeakable adversity. Michelle Knight's poignant account of her decade-long captivity in the Cleveland kidnappings is both heartbreaking and uplifting. Knight's narrative doesn't just recount the horrors she endured, but also emphasizes the strength and resilience that allowed her to survive and ultimately reclaim her life. Her raw honesty and unwavering spirit make this memoir a powerful testament to the enduring capacity of the human will to triumph over darkness. Finding Me is a stirring and empowering read that resonates long after the last page, leaving readers in awe of Knight's courage and resilience. Number 8. Hope – A Memoir of Survival in Cleveland by Amanda Berry A survivor and courageous voice emerged from the shadows of captivity to share her compelling story of resilience in Hope – A Memoir of Survival in Cleveland. As one of the victims in the Cleveland kidnappings, Berry's memoir is an intimate portrayal of her decade-long ordeal and her unyielding spirit that propelled her toward freedom. By narrating her experiences with a poignant honesty, Barry offers readers a glimpse into the profound strength that enabled her to overcome unimaginable adversity and rebuild her life. Hope is more than a memoir. It is a testament to the indomitable human spirit. Amanda Barry's narrative is a moving and courageous account of survival, resilience, and the enduring power of hope. In detailing her decade of captivity and the challenges she faced on her path to freedom, Barry's memoir is both heart-wrenching and inspiring. Her unwavering determination to reclaim her life and find solace in the face of unimaginable circumstances resonates deeply. Hope is an emotionally charged and ultimately uplifting red that showcases the strength that can be found even in the darkest of times. Number 7. Devil's Knot – The True Story of the West Memphis Three by Maura Leverett An investigative journalist and author, 
has delved into the heart-wrenching and complex case of the West Memphis Three in Devil's Knot. With a keen eye for detail and a commitment to uncovering the truth, Leverett navigates the intricacies of the legal system and societal prejudices that surrounded this infamous case. Her work is a testament to the power of investigated journalism in exposing the flaws and injustices within the criminal justice system. Devil's Knot is a riveting exploration of a real-life legal drama that captivated the nation. Mara Leverett's meticulous investigative work peels back the layers of the West Memphis Three case, exposing the flaws and biases that marred the pursuit of justice. Leverett weaves a narrative that not only chronicles the harrowing events but also highlights the complexities of the legal system. Her ability to unravel the intricacies of the case and shed light on the quest for truth makes Devil's Not a gripping and thought-provoking read. This true crime narrative is a powerful testament to the impact of media, community dynamics, and the pursuit of justice on the lives of those entangled in its web. Number 6. The Yoga Store Murder The shocking true account of the Lululemon Athletica killing by Dan Morse. An investigated journalist with a penchant for unraveling complex criminal narratives brings his expertise to the forefront in the Yoga Store Murder. As a seasoned reporter, Morse meticulously examines the shocking and tragic events surrounding the Lululemon Athletica killing. With an eye for detail and a commitment to uncovering the truth, Morse delves into the intricacies of the case, offering readers a gripping and authentic account of a crime that stunned the community. The Yoga Store murder is a chilling dive into a real-life crime that defies belief. Dan Morse's journalistic prowess is evident as he meticulously reconstructs the events surrounding the Lululemon Athletica killing. The narrative unfolds with a compelling blend of detail and empathy, providing readers with a visceral understanding of the human elements at play. Morse's ability to navigate the complexities of the case and present a balanced account makes this true crime tale a riveting and thought-provoking read. As he peels back the layers of the investigation, Morse invites readers to contemplate not only the horrors of the crime, but also the broader implications on the lives entangled in its aftermath. Number 5. Death's Acre Inside the legendary forensic lab, the body farm where the dead do tell tales by William M. Bass, a forensic anthropologist and pioneer in the field, stands as a key figure in unraveling the mysteries of death and decomposition. In Death's Acre, Bass takes readers on a riveting journey inside the legendary body farm, a research facility where the secrets of forensic science come to light. With a wealth of experience and a commitment to advancing forensic knowledge, Bass illuminates the intricate and often surprising ways in which the dead communicate their stories. Death's Acre is a fascinating and enlightening exploration of the world of forensic science. William M. Bass, with his pioneering work at the Body Farm, offers readers a rare glimpse into the meticulous and groundbreaking research conducted in the field of forensic anthropology. The book, co-authored with journalist John Jefferson, seamlessly combines scientific rigor with accessible storytelling. From the innovative techniques used to decipher time of death to the unexpected insights gained from decomposing bodies, Bass provides an engrossing narrative that demystifies the work of forensic scientists. Death's Acre is not just a captivating read for true crime enthusiasts, but also a celebration of the dedication and ingenuity of those committed to solving the mysteries that the dead leave behind. Number 4. William Bonin The True Story of the Freeway Killer True Crime by Evil Killers Number 10 by Jack Rosewood A prolific author in the realm of true crime has carved a niche for himself by delving into the darkest corners of criminal history. In William Bonin, The True Story of the Freeway Killer, Rosewood meticulously reconstructs the chilling narrative of one of America's most notorious serial killers. Known for his ability to unravel complex criminal tales with a keen eye for detail, Rosewood takes readers on a haunting journey into the life and crimes of William Bonin, shedding light on the macabre deeds that earned him the moniker The Freeway Killer. In William Bonin, the true story of The Freeway Killer, Jack Rosewood masterfully navigates the harrowing details of a real-life horror story. Rosewood's narrative prowess is evident as he unfolds the chilling chronicle of William Bonin's heinous crimes. The book is a riveting exploration of the dark recesses of the human psyche and the complexities surrounding criminal investigations. Rosewood's ability to craft a gripping tale while maintaining sensitivity to the victims makes this true crime account a compelling and thought-provoking read. For those intrigued by the intricacies of criminal psychology and the pursuit of justice, Rosewood's storytelling prowess is sure to leave a lasting impression. Number 3. Daughter of the White River 
Depression-era treachery and vengeance in the Arkansas Delta by Denise White Parkinson. An author with a passion for historical true crime brings a unique perspective to her work. In Daughter of the White River, Parkinson unravels a tale of treachery and vengeance set against the backdrop of the Depression-era Arkansas Delta. Drawing on her skill for historical storytelling, Parkinson offers readers an immersive journey into a gripping narrative inspired by true events. Her dedication to capturing the essence of the time and place enhances the authenticity of this historical true crime tale. Daughter of the White River is a captivating journey into a forgotten chapter of American history, masterfully crafted by Denise White Parkinson. In this historical true crime narrative, Parkinson skillfully resurrects the events of Depression-era Arkansas immersing readers in a tale of treachery and vengeance. The book not only serves as a chronicle of a particular moment in time but also as a testament to Parkinson's meticulous research and storytelling finesse. With a blend of historical accuracy and narrative flair, Parkinson transforms a true story into a compelling and immersive experience. Daughter of the White River is a must-read for those who appreciate the intersection of history and true crime, offering a haunting portrayal of a bygone era. Number 2. Return to Smutninos Island and Other Main Axe Murders by Merrick Spooner A meticulous chronicler of true crime brings a keen eye for historical detail to the chilling narratives of Return to Smutninos Island and Other Main Axe Murders. A dedicated researcher and writer, Spooner navigates the annals of Maine's history to unearth forgotten tales of violence and intrigue. In this exploration of axe murders, Spooner invites readers to delve into the darker corners of the state's past revealing the macabre stories that have left an indelible mark on its landscape. Return to Smutninos Island is a compelling journey into the obscured corridors of Maine's history, masterfully told by Americ Spooner. With meticulous research and a knack for storytelling, Spooner unveils a collection of true crime tales that transcend the boundaries of time. The narratives are haunting and resonant, offering readers a glimpse into the mysteries that linger in the shadows of Maine's past. Spooner's ability to bring historical crimes to life, coupled with his dedication to authenticity, makes this book an engrossing read for true crime enthusiasts and history buffs alike. It's a testament to Spooner's skill that these long-forgotten stories, filled with suspense and tragedy, are brought vividly back to life. Number 1. Mommy Deadliest by Michael Benson A seasoned true crime author delves into the realm of familial horror with Mommy Deadliest. Known for his ability to navigate the intricacies of criminal narratives, Benson brings his expertise to the chilling tale of a mother-turned-murderer. With a commitment to unraveling the complexities of true crime, Benson explores the depths of the human psyche and the disturbing events that can transpire within the supposed safety of family bonds. In Mommy Deadliest, Michael Benson unveils a harrowing true crime narrative that grips readers from beginning to end. Benson's storytelling prowess shines as he delves into the disturbing dynamics of a mother's descent into darkness. The book not only serves as a chilling account of a familial tragedy, but also explores the psychological intricacies that underscore such crimes. Benson's narrative style strikes a balance between empathy and scrutiny, inviting readers to contemplate the unraveling of lives within the seemingly secure confines of family. Monty Deadliest is a riveting exploration of the sinister twists that can lurk behind the facades of domesticity, leaving an indelible impact on those drawn to the chilling tales of true crime. As we wrap up this exploration of the reading list, it's evident that the podcast's influence extends beyond audio storytelling into the realm of gripping literature. These recommended books stand as testaments to the enduring allure of true crime and the human capacity to endure and overcome the darkest of circumstances. Whether you're a seasoned true crime enthusiast or a newcomer to the genre, the Morbid Podcast book recommendations promise a chilling yet captivating reading experience that will linger long after you turn the final page. Happy reading and may you find yourself enthralled by the mysteries and horrors that these carefully curated books unveil. If video helps you find the next book you are going to read, then like and share this video. Let me know in comment section on what type of books I should cover in my next video. Also, if you read one of the book mentioned in this video, share your review or thoughts with us. Subscribe this channel for more such awesome videos. Thanks for watching.